today uh, we saw for the first time in a long time uh, a brief uh, positive step which we hope will be sustained uh, if this very fragile uh, initial opening is respected and sustained uh, and, and that must include the pullback uh, of Syrian forces from populated areas, the pullback of their heavy weapons and the return to barracks, as Kofi Annan said today, then perhaps we will have the beginning of the six-point plan process that we fully support. The moment of truth has come and we are challenging these forces which were betting on the failure, failure of Mr. Kofi Annan's plan. It's a challenge for all of us as far as the Syrian government is concerned. We are committed and we would like to see everybody else on board. Opposition leaders must finally formulate their attitude towards political dialogue because, I mean, uh, not only our delegation, other delegations uh, were speaking about the need for political process in Syria, but there can be no political process uh, without political dialogue. And frankly, there is one thing which uh, Ms. Tanan, I hope, uh, is going to uh, accomplish very soon. Clear-cut agreement by uh, opposition uh, leaders uh, to enter into dialogue with the Syrian government. That, this uh, so far has not happened. China welcomes the announcement made by Syrian government to implement ceasefire and withdraw troops from some cities and towns. In our view, this is a very important step toward political settlement in Syria and also marks very important a progress in Coffee Annan's mediation efforts.